This video is inspired by the bracelet made of paper clips and marbles. You're going to take a paper clip and open it up. You just go slowly with the pliers. This is the extra large size paper clip, so it's quite stiff, a little hard on your fingers. You can also use 18 gauge wire or even 16 gauge wire. We'll start the same way we made the bracelet and we're going to take a marker, this is the Crayola marker, and we're just going to twist this around so it's somewhat centered. And then we're going to bring this one around and this one around. And then get a smaller size circle, this is the Sharpie, and we're just going to twist this around again. Flip it and twist this one around again. From there I'll get the round pliers. These are some heavy duty round pliers. You can also use the six step looping pliers by Beadsmith. So we want to take this and roll this around to make a closed loop. And then we can take some smaller round pliers and just work it in a little bit more. You just want to kind of close it up a little bit and flick of the wrist to bring it in. Over here we'll do the loop as we did in the bracelet tutorial and just bring it up so it's perpendicular to the piece. And then from there we can actually take this and rotate it in, keeping this perpendicular. So just bring this one in and we're curving it in like that. So just take this, curve it in, flick of the wrist, just to bring it in a little bit. So we've got something like this and we want to open it up. You can unwind it a bit if it's too small. These ones you can adjust as well. Take the marble and pop it in there. And then from there we're just going to take this and push it down. You can also take the flat pliers and just wiggle it around back and forth. You can even use the side of the pliers to push it down. Get this part as centered as you can. You can put the pendant on an adjustable leather or waxed cotton cord. I'll link up a tutorial for that below. Or you can get one of these funky ball chains like you see on umbrellas and just slide the chain through here. Make sure your loop is big enough and just attach it in there like that to make a funky little pendant on a ball chain. Another way to wrap it is inspired by Elmarie's pendant that was inspired by a previous of my tutorials. And you would just get the paper clip and bend it in half, make it curved so it's more or less in half. And then we're just going to start the curve with our pliers. So this end is a bit curved and then get the round form and hold that and bring one end around like that and then the other end around below it. So this is our beginning stage and then for the bottom one we'll take the end and close a loop with the round pliers and then just curve it in so it will hold the marble underneath. You can take this and just rotate it in with a flick of the wrist like that. And then the top one we'll do as before. We're going to do a loop perpendicular to the piece. And then we want to take that and bend it in. Just curl it in a little bit so it'll be somewhat centered. So this is our initial cage and then we're going to take our marble and just stick it right in there. Adjust this if you need. This one I put on the adjustable cord. I will link up that tutorial below.